In 1989, U.S. Mint produced over 7 billion cents in Philadelphia and over 5 billion in Denver. Therefore, they are pretty easy to locate up to Mint Day 66. At Mint Day 67, they become somewhat relatively scarce. At Mint Day 68, they are highly elusive, with PCGS population less than 50 examples and guiding price of $375. Anything above MS-68 is considered numismatic rarity and is worth over $3,000. Welcome back to CoinUs. In this episode, I'm going to show you most expensive 1989 Lincoln Sense. This is a solidly struck piece with magnificent red color. Lustrous surfaces are devoid of mentionable marks or spots. Graded at Mint Day 68 red, it was sold for $4,112.50 in 2013. Here is 1989D Lincoln Sand at Mint Day 69 red. Superb gem lacking just one grade for perfection. Orange coppery surfaces are devoid of visible contact marks. Strike is very sharp. Sold on August 9, 2020 for $1,023.60 at 30 auctions. Moving on to this very rare error penny, 1989 cent struck on a 1982 copper planchet. The remarkable aspect of this intriguing mint error is that copper planchets were last used for coinage in 1982, seven years before this piece was struck. Perhaps the copper planchet remained hidden for years within the crevices of mint machinery or transport equipment. Or perhaps a planchet supplier mixed in a copper planchet that had been set aside as a souvenir. Sold on January 4, 2018 for $7,500 at Heritage Auctions. Next comes another error cent from 1989. Lincoln cent struck on a 1988 P-dime. A 1988 P-dime apparently became wedged in a crevice of a tot bin and remained there until the date changeover of the cent dies. Roosevelt gaze is due north relative to the portrait of Lincoln. The profiles of both presidents are present. The dime date is complete and the dime mint mark is bold. The date is nearly complete with the right portion of 9 absent. Sold on April 26, 2013 for $2115. If you have such rare pennies, feel free to showcase them on our website. Thecoinas.com. Registration and publishing ad is free. Have a nice day.